Hi, and welcome to today's new quick tip. This is Pedro Flores for VFX Lunchbox. In today's tip, we're going to cover tool sets. And the tool sets allow you to be very efficiently by recreating parts of our comp uh, over and over again very fast. In this case, in order to create a tool set, you could think of it as a preset. So we have a section here called finalization section, which we could add it to any of our scripts over and over and over again. So if we had 20 or different shots and we need to do exactly the same finalization stage, we don't want to be creating that section over and over. So we want to cut down on time and we're going to cut down on setup. So in this case, we could set a preset uh, for our artists to use throughout the pipeline, throughout the show. So in order to create a tool set, it's very simple. After you have created the section that you want, select, for example, that backdrop node that has all the finalization stage. And uh, we're going to go ahead and go to this little section called the tool sets. So you're going to find it on the nodes bar there. And we're going to click on create. And the tool set is very simple. Just give it a name. So in this case, finalization setup. And after you're done, you're going to hit create. After you have done that, you go back to that menu and you will see that your finalization setup will be there. So the cool thing about this is that you could go completely to another comp. And now if you're working with multiple artists, you could provide this tool uh, preset to every single one of them. And they're able to just go ahead and load the preset right into Nuke again. So we're going to go here to the by tool presets or tool sets and go finalization setup. And there we go. Now the artist will have a finalization setup all ready to go. The only thing that they have to do is connect it and tweak it. And that should be it. Now, some people ask where you can find this uh, preset that has been generated for you. Well, if you go ahead into your .nuke directory on your specific user account, .nuke is usually a hidden folder, uh, and you're going to find a folder called their toolsets. And in there, you can find anything that you have done uh, as a toolset, you will find it there. What this allows you to do is to modify your menu.py, your init.py, and set it up to a different menu. So you can have your own menu that has all these different presets on there and it will help your pipeline immensely. So that's it for today's uh, new quick tip. This has been Pedro Flores for VFX Lunchbox. Bye-bye.